Welcome to Gadget HQ's exclusive campsite. I mean, it's so exclusive, there's only us here. <laughs> <laughs> and we've brought the authentic British weather with us. Yes, indeed, yes. we did. So, the first bit of tech we'd like you to take a look at is this. With Karina not being quite as fond of sleeping in the great outdoors as husband Rob and son Seb, gadget number one is a luxury tent. And this one's got a hidden trick up its sleeve. It's pump upable. Stick that in there, and then you get your pump on. Oh, yeah. That's the challenge. <laughs> <laughs> you can also inflate the tent using an electric pump, but we haven't got one of those to hand. Sorry, Karina. Thankfully, with the rest of the family on hand to provide a little bit more muscle power... That's it. ..the Lotus Bell Air Bud quickly takes shape. Oh! oh. Oh, look at that! Oh, oh, oh. It's a bell tent, beautifully teardrop in shape, um, and it doesn't have a central pole like most bell tents have, so there's more room to move around inside. The tent is eight feet high, meaning it's perfect for six foot plus Rob. It's also nearly ten feet wide, so there's plenty of room for the whole family and all of your camping gear. Rob, you can stand fully up. The skin is treated polycotton, so great in all weathers and long-lasting. What, what are your thoughts? I love it. The, the height, the ability to move around it, incredible. Because uh, normally you're just squished into a tiny thing. I think that's something that's going to make you slightly happier than what you normally are in a tent. Well, I'm impressed, yeah. Yeah, it's bright as well, so I don't feel like it's too dark inside, mm. isn't it? I think... This is better because I'm able to actually like, move freely around the space. Yeah, you can do handstands in there if you want to. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's roomy, it's spacious, it's modern, it's £960. OK, well, that's cheaper than a hotel for a week. <laughs> <laughs> I love your positivity. <laughs> I think that uh, the price is something that would force Karina to do even more camping than what she would normally do. <laughs> Despite the lofty price, the lofty tent impresses and may even be the difference when trying to convince Mum Karina to go camping. But we are far from done, as next I've got something which will keep the whole family toasty all night long. Look at My these, goodness. some really nice, warm sleeping bags. Look at that. Not only does the Van Gogh Radiate sleeping bag look the part, it's also packed with tech. It's got this graphene heating element to keep you very toasty on those camping nights. Graphene is a highly conductive material, which means this sleeping bag can warm you up by simply plugging in an external battery over USB. There are actually four different settings you can choose from. Red is the hottest setting. Oh, this is very warm. Is it warming up? <laughs> are you warming up? Can you feel it working already? <laughs> I will stay here. <laughs> <laughs> now, I think I'm going to keep one of these in there for just watching telly sometimes indoors. <laughs> I feel like the inside of a burrito. <laughs> so these sleeping bags cost £90 each. That's fairly reasonable against what a, a sort of high-quality down sleeping bag would cost anyway, but it's got a greater versatility to it. Karina really does feel the cold, so this, this will make the difference. Looks like we may have a new front runner, <laughs> but before they choose their favourite, it's time to make dinner for camp, courtesy of gadget number three. To add a bit more glam to your food, how about a stone-baked pizza? Oh, my gosh. So it uses hardwood pellets, which look like this. All right. OK, these go in your hopper at the top. Uh -huh. You'll get up to 500 degrees Celsius wow. in there, so that's hot enough to cook your pizzas in 60 seconds. What? The Uni Fira will not only cook pizzas in a snap, but it's portable too. It weighs just 10 kilos and the legs can be folded up, all for 249 quid. The question is, what do the pizzas taste like? Now, all the ingredients there for you to make your own. Take it away. <laughs> Gentle shake and wiggle. Gen Lovely job. Oh, gorgeous. OK. And with that, the pizza is in the oven. Problem is, with such a quick cooking time, you have to stay on your toes. 20 seconds? Yes. Let's do it. So now is a difficult bit. 
of trying to rotate. Oh, look at that. Pizza back in, then pizza back out for one last turn. Wow. Then before you know it, one minute is up and it's pizza o'clock. Faster than a takeaway. Oh, oh yeah. wow. it smells good. It really does. Do you want to slide it onto there? Wow. Look at that. It smells very good. That is good. Mmm, that's yeah. good. Yeah, yeah. it actually tastes good. Thumbs up on the taste test then, but is it worth the 249 price tag? I think that's reasonable because not only will we use that for camping, we use that in the garden, so I think uh, we'll get the money out of that very quickly. So, yeah, I like it. I mean, who wouldn't like a piping hot pizza in just 60 seconds? But will the pizza tech be the piece of tech they choose as their favourite? Or will it be the rather pricey bell tent from Lotus Bell? Or perhaps they'll plump for the sleeping bags with built-in tech to keep you as snug as a bug in a graphene-filled rug. Which one is your favourite? Uh, for me, I do like the idea of the tent best, because I love the height. Karina, do you agree? Um, I will like it's the, the sleeping bag. Oh! Ah. Very warm. Okay. 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 I really like um, the... The oven. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like a bit of a stalemate then, but a competition ain't a competition unless there's a winner. So which one is it going to be? Um, I think we all enjoyed the sleeping bag and how hot it was inside. Yeah, because you can use that all year round in yes, the house, wherever you house, go. Yes, yes, that's <laughs> what I like, yeah. We'll never get you out of the sleeping bag, will we? <laughs> so with your winning piece of tech, will you go camping a little bit more often? Yes. Yeah! yeah!